What is up, everybody? Welcome to Geek Open Mic. I'm Josiah Leroy. With me, Adam Herr and Sam Budzinski. I got it right the first you time. Did. A uh, few things uh, that we liked or did not like from the world of geek last week. I'm going to start with Adam. I uh, have a feeling that it's... <laughs> I'm not going to Adam. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He told me not to start with him. Sam, I'll go with you first. What did you like or dislike from the week at Geek? Uh, what I like, um, that um, it's Spirited Away's 15th year anniversary. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Um, like this. So what they're doing for it is that select theaters in the U.S. will have a two-day um, release of Spirit Away in theaters. So yay! And Hao Miyazaki is actually coming out of retirement. I think this has been rumored for a while. But it says that he's going to be working on another film. Oh! <laughs> I'm super pumped. So Very good. I'd be excited. Uh, Pavlox clearly excited about him the camera. <laughs> um, I'll let Adam stew a little bit longer. Um, Eurogamer released a report this week that the Marvel game, the Marvel Telltale crossover, if you will, that's coming out presumably next year is going to be a Guardians of the Galaxy episodic adventure. Uh, if you know anything about me, you know that I love Telltale games and I love Guardians of the Galaxy, so I think that that's going to be awesome. Uh, we've <laughs> known that a Marvel game is coming for the long, longest time now, at least a, a solid few years. Uh, it would coincide with Guardians of the Galaxy 2, which comes out May 5th of next year. Pretty excited about that. Give me five episodes. I don't care if I'm Star-Lord or Rocket or I am Groot. You tell me. Or Gamora. You know, whatever. It doesn't matter. Wow, way to be sexist and leave out the girl. I'm wearing her color here, so <laughs> don't be that guy. Is it my turn? Yeah, just get your turn over with your little battlefield. Yeah. All right. Uh, he has Ebola. Battlefield. <laughs> I have a Ebola? Wow, all right. That escalated quickly. Uh, battlefield finally gets patched. Um, not the best patch in the world, seeing how it left some things not entirely fixed and made some new problems, but uh, some of the improvements, they buffed some of the LMGs, so they're actually worthwhile to use now. Uh, they added a quit button, so you can quit at your heart's content whenever you feel like quitting. You can just quit. Why is that a thing? Why? Why is what a thing? Why, why should you be able to quit a multiplayer game easily? Come on. Because if people need to go to work... And they're playing a game. Those people like, need better time management. Yeah, oh, time that's true. management. Yeah, I'm one of those people, so shut up, and it's not your turn anymore. Dice get uh, your crap together, <laughs> Adam, you too. Um, and they added the rent a server feature. However, you can't kick people out of your server. You can't ban people out of your server. So if somebody's cheating, well... You just hope they hit that quit button. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> you're basically, you're, you're hoping that they become good human beings and stop cheating. You just um, death risk. Yeah. <laughs> so... If the internet has taught us anything, it's okay to be mean to people. It's a, it's a lukewarm patch. They can't find patch. you. Or can they? It's a, it's a lukewarm patch. It's like a, it's a, it's a patch that they put on underwater, so it's kind of slowly falling off. Like a lukewarm pool. <laughs> yeah, kind of. That's, no, 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 no. that's a throwback. There's, there'll be a link in the description. Just kidding, not really. <laughs> Me and Nick's going to hot tub. <laughs> so messed up. Uh, what was your favorite part of the weekend, Geek? Uh, maybe there's something you didn't like. Adam's kind of uh, in between on one. Yeah. Sam's very excited about hers. I'm very excited about mine. Leave us a comment below. If you like this video, please click the like button. And if you want to see more, subscribe. Thanks for watching.